Many people still do not understand the Apple transplant battery very well. If your Apple phone battery life is not good and needs replacement, replacing it with a third-party battery above Apple's will trigger pop-up location parts. Currently, the most cost-effective solution is uniform batteries. Today, let's take a recycled iPhone 12 Pro to demonstrate the entire battery replacement process. First, let's test if the airtightness of this iPhone 12 Pro is good. This original machine still has some airtightness. If the health of the phone's battery drops below 80%, it will heat up and throttle during daily use. The video is a bit long, so friends planning to change the battery can watch patiently. After heating the phone, drip some alcohol around the screen. Use a blade to slowly lift the screen along the seam. Now, slowly separate the screen from the casing with your nails. Personally, manual screen disassembly feels like the most reliable method. Remove the screws and take off the screen shield. Unclip the battery cable and the screen cable. Protect the facial recognition module. Then, add a bit of alcohol and pry up the battery with a prying tool. Deal with any remaining battery adhesive. It was destined to be an encounter. Next, proceed to handle the battery by tearing it off. When autumn comes, we fill our pockets with dates from the date sticker hill. Cut off the encrypted battery wires with ceramic scissors. Use a grinder to smooth out the remaining battery device. Two. Just. Grind the positive and negative poles of the small board flat. I recall we were lovers, then war erupted, turning it into a battlefield. The replacement batteries currently use the Polytrust brand. Prepare for the battery transplant. We keep repeating like this. Fold the corners of the cushion neatly. Saying goodbye for now, indicating a future reunion. Apply the thermal paste. Align the encrypted board correctly. Take out the spot welder below for welding. This is the result after welding is completed. Trim off the excess parts. Cut back to the insulating protective sticker. Put on a new battery pack label. Gently roll over the shoulder. Your same smile. Put on new battery glue, the story of your growth at the other end of the sky, missing has never stopped. You won't. You are all here. Do not ask me this. Use a roller to flatten the battery glue. The next most time consuming part is dealing with the residual glue on the edges. It took me 20 minutes to deal with the leftover adhesive on this machine. For models above iPhone 12, the material of the waterproof adhesive is different from before. As the phone ages, the waterproof adhesive strip deteriorates along with the dirt accumulated around the screen edges, so it really wastes a lot of time to deal with. There is really too much dirt on this machine, so I decided to remove the bottom component. Using a narrow blade, scrape off the remaining adhesive little by little. To carry out high standard repairs is really not a simple task, it is time consuming and laborious, requiring attention to every detail. Whether it's a phone brought in by a customer for repair, or a second hand phone sold in our store, we will always adhere to such a standard, such a spirit, persistently. Of course, there are still many areas for improvement, and I will continue to explore, learn, and enhance. The road ahead is long and arduous, I will search high and low. Finally, we apply the original waterproof adhesive. To restore the factory effect as much as possible. Thank you very much to the friends who can see this, thank you for your support and companionship all the way. Wipe the dirt around the screen clean. Fasten the screen. Assemble the back plate and screws. I carry luggage heavier than my body, and clean the inside of the machine. Are you sure this is the place? I peel off the waterproof adhesive sticker. Taking away my belongings with scissors. Remove the facial protective sticker. Close the screen. 
until I hear a sound. I am sure it's you. Finally, we will turn on the phone and test its basic functions for critical messages. But how can I inform you? Clean the receiver and speaker dust. I'll go. Finally, heat the phone for two minutes and place it in the pressure mold. After 10 minutes of pressurization, we take out the phone. Next, let's test the air tightness of the phone. If you feel comfortable, and you always prefer the needle to slowly drop, the phone has regained its air tightness.